Hello, day family. Welcome back to my channel. Today, I'm going to be doing a um, small tutorial on how to, well, this is my first time, so it's not really how to. I'm going to be doing a face mask with the turmeric powder. I seen a couple of uh, videos online and I like them and I wonder if it's going to work for me because I have eczema really bad and in the winter time my face dries up really really bad like real bad and I've been trying for so long to find different items that I can use to moisturize my face and keep it all together and moisturize and purified and hydrated and looking up you know but Ain't nothing been working for me. Everything I use, it breaks my face out. Like, literally everything I use. I didn't try black soap. I didn't try Neutrogena. I didn't try uh, that Clearasil. I didn't try some of, literally some of everything. And it don't work for my face. And I did some research on this turmeric powder. I did a lot of research on it. And it says it's good for people with eczema type skin. So, I'm trying to see if this going to work for me. If this works for me, I'm going to continue to use it. And I would recommend everybody else to use it. But this is my first time. I'm going to do a five-day challenge with it to see if it's going to work and see if I see any pro progress in it. Because I know it ain't going to be just an overnight thing. It's going to take some time, and I have to stay dedicated and committed to doing it. It's, and you're supposed to do it at least uh, two to three times a week. You're not supposed to do it daily. So I'm going to do it every other day or just three times a week. I'm going to try it. But I have the turmeric powder. I keep saying turmeric, I'm sorry. I found the correct say it, how to pronounce it. It's turmeric, turmeric powder. Okay, it's the organic kind. I got it from Walmart. And then I have, uh, that I'm gonna mix with it that I say online too as well, the other ingredients, is some coconut oil. I'm gonna use this coconut oil. And I got a lemon too as well. A lemon. I'm gonna put all the ingredients in the description box to let you know what I use and what is it for. Because right now I can't really tell you what it's for. I just know I just want it to work. And I got some vitamin E oil. I'm gonna use this too as well. But I'm gonna put this on maybe afterwards. Well, I may put a little bit in there too for the paste to let it sink in. And then I'm gonna use some afterwards too with a little bit of coconut oil after I rinse my face and let that sink in. And you know. So, I'm about to get ready to get into the video, and, and I hope you guys like this video. If you like it, subscribe, comment, and make sure you hit that bell, and give me a, um, a suggestion on any, any other type of face mask you think you can, I could use for eczema. Like, I have eczema type skin, and then, you know, the little pimples that I do have. But yeah, let me know what you guys think, and I will be right back, right back.
Okay, you guys. So now I'm going to be washing my face with a hot towel. A hot clean towel. A wash towel. <laughs> to open up my pores. Even though I just washed my face because I just got out the shower. But I'm going to wash it again. So I can apply this mess. I know it's weird with me doing it in the living room. But I feel comfortable in here. So I'm going to... Wash my face. Make sure it's nice and wet and damp. Okay. And I will be using my fingers for this because I don't have any sticks. Any, like, sticks or... I'm not going to mess up my makeup brushes for this. I would rather use my fingers because I can always wash my hands and it's going to come out. So... Oh, I do have a makeup sponge that I brought in here. What do I do with it? Never mind. I'm just going to use this. I made my hand. As you can see, it's nice and all thick. Nice and thick. And now I'm going to go and apply it. I'm just going to use my hand. Put it on my face. So you got to let it sit for like 15 to 20 minutes. So I'm going to let it sit. This is really messy. Maybe I should have got something to use. I probably this stuff hurts for my face. Because I didn't try so much stuff. I'm tired of my skin looking all dry and raggedy and have to wear makeup all the time because I don't like my skin. Even though it's not that bad, I just don't like it. Oh, oh my God. Yeah, I'm messing up, y'all. Yeah. I didn't get it all over me. It's okay. Yes. This does smell. It smell like I'm just smacking food on, on, on my face. Smell of lemon juice. Okay. I know. I, I hope I ain't boring you guys. I'm just trying to put this on. Put it on there real nice and good. Okay. I put it everywhere because I want to know if it's going to work. I just hope, like they said, it turned your skin yellow. <laughs> Not Oh my God. I just hope my skin don't turn all orange. And I hope it don't break me out. I hope it don't break me out, y'all. I just hope, and I got turmeric powder all over my chest. Like, all over me. Now I need my daughter's help. Because I can't get up. I have a napkin. Let me get this napkin. Put, it, put that in there. See? Got my napkin. Always prepared. What kind of... I just Let me know what kind of face mask and things you guys be using. Even though I probably can't use the same stuff you use. But if you have that eczema, eczema skin type... Let me know what you use, because it's hard for a sister like me with eczema to find something to, oh, this stuff is everywhere. To find something to, um, not, oh, my face is burning. It's burning. I hope this don't affect me. But, yeah, to find something to, um, clear the eczema up. I'm tired of it, y'all. I'm tired. It grows in different spots, like. I done had it since I was, 
I'm going to say, since I can remember, and I, and last time I remember, I was like five, four or five years old, and it used to come up my arm really, really bad, and it moved from my arm, and I used to have it up here like a big old mustache, y'all. <laughs> it was a big mustache right here, and it just grows from different places. Like, you never know what, what spider's area is going to be in next, so. I don't know. I just hope it works. I just really hope it works. I got this stuff everywhere. Lord, help me. But I'll be back. I'm going to let this sit for like uh, 15 more minutes. It said 20 to 25 minutes or 15 to 20 minutes. I'm going to let it sit for at least 20 minutes. And then I'm going to wash my face off. And I will be back once I rinse. Well, I'm going to let you guys see me rinse. But I'll be right back. Okay, guys, I'm back. Yeah, I let it sit for 25 minutes. I let it for sit for 25 minutes, and now um, it feel like hard a little bit. It got hard and just itch just a little bit. It's it's not too bad, but I'm gonna wipe it off now with a hot hot towel. I got my bowl of hot water sitting here. <laughs> Let's see how this go. Woo! Look at the towel. It's a lot. Gotta rinse that out. I should have did this in the bathroom. I'm just being lazy. Okay. See how all this oh, this works. I'm gonna try this again in the next Day, well, I'm gonna say today is Thursday, Thursday night, it's nine o'clock, so I'll try it again Saturday. Try it again Saturday. Well, I should even try it tomorrow. I may, I don't know. I'm just gonna make sure I do it three times a week so I can see some progression pretty soon and not late, you know. So I really want to know if this stuff really works. Okay. Ooh, they got it in my mouth. I'm going to give it this towel a rinse one more time. Okay, so now it's off. I'm going to uh, just put some. What I do with it? I'm always moving some, y'all. I don't ever know what I do with stuff. Okay, here it is, right here. So now I'm going to do the coconut oil. Excuse my hands too, my nails. I know they're a mess. I just was taking them off, and it's hard for them to come off right now. They hurt. My last two nails on both fingers hurt okay so now I'm going to take a little dab of this coconut oil I'm not going to put too much on it because I, I can't stand oil too much so I'm going to put that much it's melting it's melting 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 I'm going to put that much on it with a little vitamin E oil mix it in there just a dab of it I wish I had an aloe vera plant. When I went to Walmart, I had got some, um, when I brought the turmeric powder, I know you guys sent it in my last video, but I had got um, 
some aloe vera is like some juice. You're supposed to drink it for your health. And I was looking for the actual plant. But me being me, always buying some and trying some, I got it anyway. I'm going to let you guys know what that's about too. And I think I put too much oil. Too, too much. Already the little shine. My face is already naturally oily, but in the winter time it just gets so dry. Okay, let me get this. I was just showing you guys a little tutorial on my first time trying this turmeric powder. I'm going to come back sometime next week to see if anything has changed. See if any of the dark spots, because it's supposed to be for dark spots too as well. See if your dark spots and all that good stuff. Not just for eczema, just for like dark spots, pimples. Real bad acne is supposed to work. It's like a, I think an Indian, they said, Indian or Arab, something like that. It's something that they use. You know, I trust the Indians and the Arabs and stuff, you know. But really the Indians. Okay. Okay, my face is nice and clean now. Nice and clean, nice and clean. Okay, as you guys can see, you can see the little bumps and stuff, but it's going to get better. It's going to get better. I'm going to make sure it get better. I'm going to do my, my best to do what I can to get this face popping. It's already popping, but I'm just saying. I'm just saying. Get it popping, popping. You know, you know, you know. Get all the look, you know. Even though, look, my hair is so nappy. But anyways, you guys. I'm getting off the subject, but if you like this video, make sure you like it. Hit the like button. Like it. If you like it, just like, hit the like button. Make sure to subscribe down below in the comment section. Make sure you do that. And hit the notification bell too as well, just in case I upload a video and you won't miss out on it. You can get every, every, y'all gotta excuse me, <laughs> but you gotta get every video that I upload if you hit that notification bell. Do that favor for me and I'll do it for you. Thank you. Oh, shoot.